G'day Gemini, welcome back to TJ Terror Down Under. Gonna do the love energy coming towards you as at now. Let's go. Give me three cards for the love energy coming towards Gemini, please. So this is a general reading. Take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate at all, you can check out your other placements. Or you can check out my playlists, which are massive. <laughs> And see if there's anything there that matches your current timeline, which I'm sure there will be. Clarify card one, please. Cross watches, this could be your energy. If not, it will be somebody else's. So please do keep that in mind, as you may not be the only one thinking about Gemini right now. Clarify card two, please. Daisy. Clarify card three, please. All the decks are pre shuffled and are listed below in the description box in the order that I'm using them in case you're interested in what these decks are. All except for the handwritten deck that I use at the very end. Three more cards for the love energy coming towards Gemini, please. Just a plain deck with handwritten messages. So, hope you're all doing well and taking care of yourselves wherever you are. Hope you're having a good day. And most important, as I say every week, if you haven't done anything nice for yourself this week, make sure you do something nice for yourself. Clarify card one in row two, please. Don't forget to spoil yourself, as I normally say. Because <laughs> you're important too, Gemini. So, don't just, you know, take care of everybody else. Don't forget to do something nice for yourself. Clarify card two in row two, please. Okay, Christmas is coming up, so get yourself something nice for Christmas. Why not? <laughs> Why not? And clarify card three, row two, please. Okay. Here we go. Alright. So, let's begin. Alright. Let's pull that up a bit. Honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Ooh, speaking of holidays. Mm, holidays are coming up. Ooh, six of wands. Three of cups. And the six of swords. Ooh, two sixes. All right. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Hoping to get your attention. It's some sort of get-together to move things to calmer waters, which is sort of what this card looks like, the normal Six of Swords in the boat moving forward. So, yeah, wanting to get your attention at a get-together, some sort of holiday function to try and get things to move forward. To calmer waters so that yeah it's not so nervous about approaching you like get the conversation started break the ice get your attention <laughs> mm, so someone's been got their eye on you Gemini stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking and faith will bring you romance so they're optimistic that there could be something between you two Move them down a bit. Ooh, six of cups. Ooh, eight of swords. Mm. And the king of wands. So this could be someone from the past. Past love. Can't stop thinking about you. Having to control their passionate actions. Control their passions for you and... Yeah, control their passion for you. 
can stop thinking about you. Well, want, maybe wanting to make memories of love with you can't stop thinking about you, has to control their passion for you. And don't know if it's someone from the past or not. Moving things to calmer waters? Hmm, maybe. But seeking your attention, see... I, I'm, not, I'm not sold on it being someone from the past yet, so, yeah, just wait. Well, you probably already know from what I've called this, but I don't know yet. It's someone from the past. <laughs> okay, so we know. <laughs> someone from the past. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Yeah, okay. So this is someone from the past. Ten of Cups. Wow. They want long-term love with you. King of Cups, they've been holding on to all these emotions for you. And the Empress. That, and their emotions, yeah, all these emotions that they're holding on to, trying to control, are just growing more and more every day. Oh, wow. Wow. Love, love, love. Because the Empress is... In the sign of Venus, which is love. Wow. Oh, wow, Gemini. Yeah, they want to move this to Karma Waters, so this get together over the holiday time. Still a bit stuck in the past, but all they do is think about you. Mm, okay. Get more information. Yeah, they mm, want to find out what you're up to. Ooh, five of pentacles out in the cold. The hermit, wow. And the page of wands. So, yeah, you've let the well, they've been out in the cold. They've been out of the loop. And they've been single and alone, out in the out in the cold again. Yeah, they haven't been in the loop. They don't know what's going on with you. So they're going to try and come in with a bit of flirty conversation here to find out. Ooh, action, because it is a one's one's energy, which is not just passionate communication. Action communication or a little bit of action, yeah, because they've been out of the loop. They, yeah, they've been out in the cold. You've possibly left them out in the cold and ghosted them, like you know, well, not in a bad way, but like lost contact with them. They haven't had any contact with you since you've left them out in the cold, well, since it ended. Hmm, taking action to find out the information that they need. Ooh. And try a bit of flirty action. But I'm not feeling that. It's just taking action to get, to, talking to, yeah, possibly talking to people that you know. Well, taking action to communicate, to get the information they need. All right. It's up to you. They know it's completely up to you. The ball is in your court, whether you let them back in or not. They know it's totally up to you, Gemini. It's not up to them. King of Cups again. King of Cups. Six of Swords again. Ten of Swords, ooh. Two of Swords, wow, lots of Swords energy. Well, it's your energy. Oh, and the Devil card. <sighs> Bit of lust in this one. But, it's, yeah, they know it's up to you. <sighs> they have to control their emotions. Unless this, yeah about this moving forward to calmer waters 
because they know they caused a painful ending with their indecision and toxic behaviour. Indecisions and toxic behaviour. So, yeah, they know that they can't control. It's up to you whether this moves to calmer waters. Yeah. Because I don't think you're showing any emotion towards him. King of Cups is full of love, but he can choose to not show any emotion because he's totally in control of his emotional actions. So they're feeling like you're not showing them any emotion. Yeah, but so it's going to be up to you whether this moves forward. Mm. There's something better, okay? Yeah. Oh, the Emperor, and there's the Empress, and the Queen of Pentacles. I think they want to offer you something better. A more ma mature and controlled person that wants love and stability and commitment. As in self-control. Uh, um, they know they should have offered you something better. They should have controlled themselves and offered love and stability here and commitment. Yeah, they know they should have offered you something better in the first place. And it could be what they want to offer now, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. They don't know whether you're, yeah, whether you'll let them back in. Okay. Yeah, but they're stuck. They can't do this anymore. They can't handle it. All right, what would this love energy like to say to Gemini, please? Just the one card. Thank you. Doki. Could we start again, please? Yeah. This is, it's exactly what they want to do. Start again. Oh, wow. Okay. Hmm. Well, as it says here, it's completely up to you, Gemini. Completely up to you. All right, I'm not going to say any more. <laughs> all right, well, that's your reading. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Leave a nice comment. That would be awesome. And thank you so much for watching every single one of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, all, all the best. Take care. Good luck. And I'll catch you later.